Good morning! Today is the day, the sun is shining, we're gonna graduate. We're gonna graduate. I hope you understood my Nemo reference there. Um, I'm obviously getting ready, I just got out of the shower. I'm gonna crack open this bubbler. I just, it's kinda hot in here. I need something cold. So, gotta do full face makeup, dry my hair, curl my hair in an hour and 15, which is totally doable for me. So, I'm gonna get started on the makeup here. I'm gonna take this off, cause it's heavy. So, I don't super remember what I said last night, um, cause that was right before I zonked out. Like, I put my phone down, I started my movie, which I watched to go to sleep, and I don't even think I got five minutes into it, I was out. So, that's good, cause it was like 10 p.m., and I was a little worried about falling asleep. <laughs> but I know I said it doesn't feel like I'm graduating yet, and I mean, I'm excited to, today, like I have butterflies, but I think it really won't set in until like after I'm done, and I think it'll come in waves, to be honest. I can't just feel it all at once. I'm sure I'll feel it even in this fall when I'm like supposed to be going back to school and I'm not. It's gonna be really weird. Like even when I graduated high school, I still went back to school in the fall because I came right to college. And I've been going to school for the last 15, 16 years of my life. And now all of a sudden I'm just not. <laughs> Which is kind of cray cray. I think today will be super fun though to like see everybody and finally like actually do the thing that we've been waiting all year to do. So that'll be really nice. That being said though, I do work a lot faster when I'm not talking and distracted by something so I'm gonna turn my music back on you guys have seen me do my makeup before and if you haven't you don't really need to it's not that special so I'm gonna drink this turn on some like nice music I have my wake up playlist going but now I'm gonna switch to like happier vibes and we're gonna get ready so I will see you guys just in a little bit when I'm ready to go Okay guys, I am all ready now, as I said I would be. I did just really simple makeup. I love my eyeliner today, which is good, <laughs> because I, it's a special day. And then I just curled my hair, and then I'm wearing this one shoulder red dress. I'll show you. I love how this dress looks on me. It makes me feel so confident. Great, right, I hope this is in focus, but here's the dress on me. I don't know, I think it makes my figure look really good. And I love, how it looks. So I'm wearing this and then my black heels that I wear for literally everything that I ever do. So it's almost 9 now and we're supposed to be there at 9.15 so we're gonna head out soon. Exciting and yeah let's put our shoes on and get ready to go. Oh I need jewelry actually. I'll probably just wear this necklace again because it's one of the longer ones that I have so it won't get lost in the one shoulder. There. I'm wearing this necklace. I've had it forever. I literally wear it for like all the time. Let's go out, get shoes on, and go to my graduation.
I turned it! I did it! <laughs> out so I hope it's not too bad I'm using my phone mic right now um, I obviously graduated yesterday as you saw <laughs> that was what this whole vlog is about um, but I didn't end it last night so I figured I'd come on I'm at the park right now enjoying a beautiful day my parents are here but they just went for a walk uh, while I talk to my camera for a little bit uh, I just kind of wanted to reflect on my whole graduation and how I'm feeling right now and how I was feeling yesterday, things like that. Um, just to kind of close out the vlog and leave you with a little more of like how I'm feeling because I didn't say too much to the camera yesterday. I just kind of vlogged the action. So hope you don't mind if we get a little sentimental here today at the park. <laughs> but um, yeah, it was... It was a great feeling yesterday to walk they mentioned during the ceremony it was the first in-person one since 2019 um so that was really special to still be able to walk and have a normal graduation and i didn't even cry at all yesterday there were two times when i did like kind of tear up but a tear never fell because i didn't want to ruin my makeup um the one time was when we were like lining up and everybody was coming in with their gowns on and it really just kind of hit me. I was like, oh my God, <laughs> I'm done with school. Which I've never felt that before. It's a different feeling from graduating high school for me because when I finished high school, I still knew that there was college to come. So I wasn't really done, you know? Um, I was never done with school. The second time I almost cried was when we were actually walking into the gym and all these people were standing on the sides of where we were walking and clapping and they, everyone looked so happy and they had their phones out and that's when it really felt real for me was everyone was watching us walk in and I had this huge smile on my face but I did like tear up and I had to like say no, no tears because it was just so exciting and such a happy moment for me. That was the only time I teared up. I didn't end up crying. My mom, on the other hand, bawled. <laughs> She's just proud of me and I'm proud of myself too. Like this is a huge accomplishment, of course. I knew I was going to do it, um, but yeah, it was such a great time. And the actual ceremony itself wasn't really that long, which is great. I think maybe an hour and a half total because we were there for two hours, but we had to take pictures and stuff afterwards. So that was that. Um, and now we, here we are today. I didn't do much after because we were done at like noon and then we had the whole day so we went on a walk and enjoyed the weather um we really just chilled for the rest of the day like it was a it was a busy morning and there was a lot going on so it was something that we just kind of wanted to chill the rest of the day I think it still hasn't fully set in yet which I don't I didn't expect it to I really expected to kind of hit in the fall because there's never been a fall where I haven't gone back to school until now so that'll be a completely different feeling than I'm used to um I've gone to school for the last 16 years of my life literally because I started kindergarten when I was five and now I'm 22 is that math right 17 years actually even longer than I thought and that's a long time but as of right now it is kind of hitting me in like different it's kind of becoming more real every time I realize something like I still feel like I have homework that I'm like missing or I should be looking at assignments or I need to log on to D2L and it just really isn't real yet. But I'm feeling really excited, really happy and really proud to have met the people that I did, uh, made all the friends that I made and had the experiences that I did. Um, college treated me really well. There was ups and there was downs as you'll have in life in general. 
no matter what you're doing. But overall, college was really good. And I want to thank the people who are watching this um, for supporting me throughout my college journey. I am, I've tried really hard to kind of come into who I am and find myself <laughs> in the least cheesy way possible. Um, but it's, it has been a journey and I'm very, very excited for what comes next. I hope you guys stick around. Um, and to my friends and family who are watching this, thank you all so incredibly much for supporting me throughout my college years. Uh, the amount of times I've called my mom to complain about the stupidest, stupidest shit. And she's listened to me every single time. And all my family and friends who put up with my silliness, <laughs> for lack of a better term. Um, I couldn't have done this without you guys. And this is really important for me. Um, and I want you guys to know that you helped me through everything. So thank you so much to all my family and friends. Um, but I think that's going to conclude this video. Uh, I've talked for longer than I thought I was going to here. Uh, I just wanted to get a little sentimental, as I said before. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I tried to get as much footage as possible yesterday for you guys. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a like and don't forget to subscribe down below to see where I go from here. And with that, I will see you guys next week for another one. Bye.